Første dag på tur. Ja da! Like å bli. Jeg tar opp nå. Ja, du tar opp i 360. Hæ? Nei, sant? Ja, ja. Du kan se meg både her og her. Og her. Og her. Moho, moho. Sånn... Hele turen skal bli dokumentert i 360. Ja, fordi det er jo utrolig mye lurt som blir der. Det er ingen som gjemmer seg. Nei, sant. Ja, først ut ned, sammen med dere ser, så har vi fått tre seters. Ja, vi er jo tre, tre mann, så... Det er jo akkurat som skara, det. Ja, det er bedre enn sånn det startet, når vi fikk to seters. Ja, ja. Ja, da. Det går i svei, da. Men, hva er det? Hvis dere, hvis dere... Så kommer det en fyr og så tar han lærer til å hjelpe dere med... Kjempebra. Så today's show is going to be in here. That's bloody amazing. I'm going to lower that screen and I'm going to project on that Eilf, it's got a very nice uh, grand piano uh, I'm going to sit over there and Andre is going to be in the middle yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Day two, day two uh, Fortunately we didn't have to rig today because rigged yesterday. Now we're happy today with this Yamaha. Oh, it's a... Oh, it's actually a Yamaha CF. A CF, yeah. It's very rare. Oh, really? Rare. 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 Actually, Ailf is sponsored by Yamaha, so he's not al he's only allowed to play on Yamaha. It's my dream, actually. Yeah. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah. So ma maybe, maybe one day. Okay, here we come. Kids on the move. Kids, kids approaching very quietly, well behaved. Okay, so this is the car. This is the cargo. This is the gear that we're using. Uh, over there in the end, there is like a big keyboard that we hope that we're never going to have to use uh, because we play acoustic music. And uh, when I say we, I include myself in the band, although I'm not making any sounds. I'm doing the introductions though. Uh, so. Yeah, some small speakers, um, a mixer, some lights, and uh, yeah, lots of cables, a projector. Basically, that's it. Hertz. Uh, hello. 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 <laughs> I'm gonna try to do a little documentary about this. Just to. Uh, To, uh, yeah. There's one guy missing though. Yeah. You're happy about the show yesterday? Uh, yeah. Yesterday was like a, a blast. Yeah. It was uh, better than the first day. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
I hope we got some really nice fish right there. Yeah. Yeah. It's like the moment when we, arrive, uh, when we arrive to the school. Yeah. <laughs> we never know where to enter. Now we need to do some cooling. Yeah, there, 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 there. Okay, super. Really good. Okay, that's it. Yeah, all right. Okay, so this is a room we're gonna play. I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna put the projector over there somewhere. The piano. I need some help with the grand piano. <laughs> yeah. I know you do. Yeah. Oh, please. Got a fluger. Please. Whoa, we've got a grand piano today. A grand piano. <laughs> oh, you can play this beautiful song. <laughs> my beautiful, my beautiful. Uh, it's the on, pianist. Yeah. The pianist has arrived. Oh. Very nice. Okay, I'm gonna get the piano through there. Uh, the pianist, he is a bit special, but he's great with the piano. Uh, a bit challenging to be right. Socially, he's very demanding. So, socially. Okay, I'm gonna put it, put you over here. concert three performances in one day it's like <laughs> one o'clock and uh, we're done for today it's crazy I'm just discussing how what the effect after you perform for like three gigs in a row is like you feel a bit sick it's like you have a fever uh, you don't have a fever but the body all the limbs are like boiling it's like cooking uh, yeah <laughs> it looks like i'm having fever <laughs> yeah and you too you have small eyes with yeah I'm not, actually i've got something in my left eye i'm trying to get rid of it oh, okay yeah. <laughs> it's not the concert <laughs> no it's not the concert <laughs> okay, my gear 
painting, camera, for painting, black magic, video, interface, um, yeah, a controller, and just a zoom recorder for audio, this for the visuals, this, and painting on this. light table. Okay, this is the setup. This is a MIDI controller. I got different layers here. As you can see, glitter. There's the camera. And this is the movie layer. This is the gaming layer. So that's it, four layers. And then I've got uh, different things here. And then with the camera, like an invert, like that. So at some point, I'm grabbing it and uh, filming. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and yeah, so that's it. And, and here, these are colors from Japan that I like. I'm gonna paint with them. There's an alcohol based uh, uh, pan. <laughs> for, yeah, pan. <laughs> I'm going to draw on these ones and I'm painting on this one. And uh, over here is uh, the brain of the visuals. This is uh, VDMX. I'm using it for doing all this stuff. Uh, so, yeah, that's it. Great. And then we've got the musical section over there. They're just following my lead. <laughs> 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 Thank <laughs> you.
Drummer po Ayo. O Andre. Andreas Set. Andreas. Super. Okay, there you go. This is Cuckoo. It's been very lovely to show you what I'm doing when I'm on tour as a visual artist as opposed to, to a synth dude. Um, I, on YouTube, I tend to, do, to post only my synthesizer and music-related stuff. But this, what you've just seen, is also part of me uh, as a visual artist. So um, this particular show is geared towards kids and teenagers, and this tour uh, has been get towards children rather than teenagers and it's going really really well and I'm so happy to see the way we can kind of bridge between the the highly complex uh, contemporary jazz music uh, through visuals to the kids I see myself and my part with the visuals as a sort of a bridge between the the kids and and the music and uh, I'm so happy to see how how the kids respond to the visuals and the music and, and they're really just absorbing it and I'm so happy for that to be able to just plant a little seed uh, in the early age of, of kids and give them a reference point of, of what you know improvised elaborate jazz and uh, contemporary music can can be all about and yeah yeah so I'm extremely happy to be doing this tour and but, but it's also wearing me out so I'm really tired doing like two or three shows a day for we've got like 21 shows in nine days that's ridiculous in many ways but that's what we're doing and yeah it's going it's going pretty well okay Everyone, uh, please uh, have a look at my new homepage. I just released a new homepage. It's uh, truecuckoo.com. And also, I released a new store uh, pretty uh, recently. Uh, it's uh, store.truecuckoo.com. And I intend to grow it uh, so you can buy all my patches and stuff there. Uh, of course, the core of my um, of my, I don't know, business model is to offer everything to my Patreon supporters. Everyone who supports me at a monthly basis, they get access to all my stuff. But if you don't want to do monthly donations, uh, I want to offer more and more stuff on my web store. So, uh, yeah, I just started it, so it's basically just two items right now, but I'm going to grow it to, to music and also merchandise after a while. And, uh, and more and more patches and downloads. Yeah, so whichever way suits you the best, please consider throwing in uh, some support. And for this year, I've been planning to go to Superbooth in, in Berlin, uh, which I'm looking forward to very much. Uh, I'm gonna use, meet a lot of uh, interesting people there, and I have some inside information about one particular synthesizer that I haven't heard any leaks from. Uh, maybe I haven't looked hard enough, but uh, it's exciting to see how it's going to be perceived. And so, no mentioning nothing more than that on this particular information. And uh, what else? Yeah, I'm planning to go visit Bastel Instruments, and I'm so happy about that. I'm also going to play a gig in Brno while there at like a Bastel um, event hosted by Bastel. That's uh, going to be very cool. So I'm looking forward to that. Also in Oslo I had like uh, an inquiry about a gig and in Stockholm I'm going to an uh, Electron Electronauts uh, meetup. I'm also going to perform a little bit there. So uh, yeah, lots of stuff coming up so the best way to, to follow my my schedule is to go to truecuckoo.com and I've got all my I'm going to try to update it all the time so you know if I'm coming to a place near you or if you if you have some requests you can start booking me uh, if you're a, you know a booking agent in your particular area please uh, make 
contact with me and and help me uh, yeah get around because I'm, I'm all about accelerating everything about cuckoo in 2017 okay that's it for this time I uh, hope you like the little sneak peek of what it's like being on tour uh, it's so lovely working with Andre and Eilf they're two highly intelligent musicians and uh, they know each other so well in terms of musical uh, well in every respect actually so when they're playing together it's like there is no communication barrier they just know what what yeah it's it's quite remarkable to to listen to how closely related they are in the music it's very cool and that's it i'm going to say goodbye now peace out everyone stay cuckoo and this 360 thing is very demanding for my personal computer setup now so i don't think i'm going to do a lot of 360 productions unless i get a, an expensive camera with onboard stitching uh, which i can't afford or a new uh, updated Mac. My Mac is five years old. Uh, I can't afford a new Mac either. So we'll see. Uh, I really like the 360. It's a nice experiment and I hope to to try it out in the future but uh, currently it's taking too much time to process for, for my gear. So yeah, it's just a little test. Cool. See you all soon. Hope to see you very soon again. Cheers.